know that time you're on a lunch date maybe for two hours yeah. with, your, with your girl, girl. And, and then suddenly you in between what's the time oh my man's here i have to go and, and you're like, like wait what it's all right easy and my <laughs> How you doing? Lebo Han Jessica Kilberman here. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome home. Get cozy, get comfortable because you are guaranteed to stay. Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to another video. We're having a sit-down video with some guests. As you can see, woo! It's gonna be crazy, not too crazy. Anyway, I'll ask them to introduce themselves. Do you want to say that again? Sorry guys, there's a bit of noise. So we'll just ask her to introduce herself again. Alright, that's all I'm saying. Hi, my name is Vanessa Wakea and you can catch me on all my social media platforms at again with Hi guys, I'm Sam and you can catch me on all the social media platforms at Sam underscore F so on. Yeah. Why are you looking at me? <laughs> My name is Miss underscore Nicole across all social media platforms and on YouTube. Hi guys, my name is Rupita Holly and you can catch me on all social media platforms at Rupita Holly. Thank you guys. Thank you. Yes, so I'm with guests. They're all YouTubers, right? I'm not mistaken. Yeah. So please do subscribe to their channels. I'll try to have their um, channels names mm. in the description <laughs> box. Anyway, so as you guys can see from the title, we're shooting a girls talk. And the whole point is we want to dissect to do friendship over the Jinzian, but I'll be giving them topics and they're just gonna talk on it, like add on to the discussion. I don't know. Okay, so the first thing is how do you guys feel about girls that embarrass their friends in front of guys? Like a, a yo dude, like you know you when you go to somebody something and then somebody gives them a compliment like oh you look so good at that. Like I know right, can I No ma'am? No ma'am. No ma'am. Ah, yes. <laughs> like yeah, another yeah, story. Story. I don't make like people in black. Happy to speak it from personal experience. Thank you. Wait, can I say something? She said it's giving very much pick me vibes. Mm. Mm. Why do you why do girls do that guys? As women, how so we are supposed to stand for each other. Not yeah. Like, yeah. 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 Like a competition. Honestly. Exactly. Yeah. You know, sometimes it's jealousy, you know? Right? Yeah, there are some people wish to have actually low self esteem. You know? I don't think it's an essence of somebody's jealous, it's just that they have a low self esteem and they want to break everybody around you down. Mm. Yeah. But people talk about why because sometimes you know you can find that this friend of yours has everything that you wish you could ever ask yeah. for. Yeah. So, so why do you feel that you're liking so much but only everything's a sin kaisa? Do you get me? Yeah. yeah. It's so weird. Well, in my case, yeah. I remember this is other girl. I used to be friends with well she's much 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 more prettier than I am. I'm still pretty though. <laughs> I'm still pretty yeah. though. But I remember this other time Lady to Lady Lego before she didn't tell us as well. Lady Lego where Colo Mula tell us that there was this other guy who was eyeing me. But my friend felt as if no, he's not supposed to be eyeing me. But she approached him. Yeah. She approached him. And you know sometimes when they approach those guys they, they'll make you seem bad so that they can put themselves in a better yeah. life than you. Girls went over time to treat this way to good life. And they really put too much effort. Friends that give their men or their man 50 million chances, 30 chances they need. But at the, at, at the, at the, at the oh. worst, not the, they're not even the worst, at the least inconvenience with you, they're ready to cut you off. I, I feel like. Because I've experienced this before. Mm -hmm. It's like, so Motel would treat Tommy a certain way, who does this and then and then and then. You're gonna keep going back to them, but something so dumb, stupid could tear us apart. So what is. I don't know. You so in love with your oppressor that you can't even have a little bit of compassion for your own people. See, this is what's wrong with you, Coons. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's very scary. Get your weapon in this thing. The, the serious weapon. No, I don't know. I feel like, personally for me, it's 
with my group of friends is I've made it very I've tried to be very vocal like you can do what you want with your partners and your other friends and everything but my friendship with you is going to be different from your other friendship with other people like you're going to be mature when you're just me if you have an issue you speak up about it don't don't be nasty don't be smart don't have the comment thing and it's like okay, if you have an issue with me come and meet let's deal with it and let's deal with it don't fight me rather fight the situation like, yes. you know, the situation mm. and then move on with that friendship because i made it clear to my friends like i have a very small circle of friends i intend to keep it that way but i will not hesitate to cut you off like if i am trying to teach you that not even my way of wanting to be friends but like just a general standard of friendship like nah friends talk things out friends mm-hmm. because friends do that mm-hmm. and you feel like i'm either being too controlling or i'm trying to roll it's out just about the direction it's like the thing is no one likes to be told like yeah yeah, yeah. 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 No, no, one like, and, and no one likes to be told i think yeah you're yeah. not doing this so no, oh, yeah happen yeah. things that maybe you find instances where you're not familiar with boundaries so when they're set up for now Yeah, but yeah. Yeah. Right along, I think going back to the topic, I don't understand how you can give your guy so many he cheats on you, he does this. Maybe he's emotionally. And then some girls feel for me, and that type of person, you know, like I've been, in, I've been in that type of situation with them for like not situation in that type of relationship with them for like the longest. So he knows me in and out. So he's my safe place. Why went to me? Some girls think like that. No, but what if he's abusive? Some girls will still remain in that relationship. And you, you, imagine for you break up, keep going back, keep going back. You know, you give your guys so many chances, but Zara Haho, I don't know what she could have done to you, and then instantly you just you cut them off. Emma. I think also, I think it's just an issue of like we overvalue things. We don't, we lack the, we lack sight. Like you don't see things for what they are, but rather for what we wish to be. Like with that guy, you feel for okay, no, this guy is doing one thing for five, six, seven, nine, ten. My friend is just my friend. So <laughs> with Zala, it's like you tend to forget for it when shit hits the fan. Zala can't who's gonna exactly yeah. who's going to be there for you? Facts. I feel like there's many fish in the sea. Do you still have, have you seen the fish? In the sea? <laughs> take on inheriting beef do you think that you should hey! inherit should you think you don't have to because the minute yeah. your friend is okay with that person when i'm saying like that you should let them be alone yeah yo but it doesn't mean that you should be friendly with that no yes okay yes i think for me it's i respect boundaries and if you have a beef with somebody i'm going to ask like why are you not getting along with this person If I feel like it's a petty issue, I'm gonna help you get over it. Like, come on, let's get over yeah, it. Yeah, because how oh, I sometimes look at each other for it. You and the person that your friend doesn't like, he actually is I. Mm. So now it's like your responsibility. <laughs> yeah. 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 And it's like, okay, let me understand what's going on. If it's something that's reasonable, then you're like, okay, fine. I'm not gonna inherit the beef. Like, I'm not gonna act if you want the person is a hound. Mm-hmm. You do that. But at the same time, I'm not gonna try to befriend them, yeah. especially in your presence, because you're gonna make it in your own friendship. So I'm, you're, you're gonna have my loyalty, but I'm not gonna inherit bullshit. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And don't expect me as your friend, because when I have a problem with that, you need to open to it up. Suddenly, yeah. You know, a, I agree with that. Oh, Might yeah. I just add? <laughs> Yeah. Okay. It's okay. Happy Amazon is too small. You're going to eventually work with some of these people in professional okay. settings. Okay. So, okay. yay. Prof that is very true. Mm. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> <laughs> this goes back to being in games, the next one. Okay. We are in a very small city, small country. Stop sharing your friend secrets. Okay. It's literally because you decided to share that thing with your friend and then their friend decides to share with their close friend and then that close friend shares with another close friend. Constantly a, a, a random person comes up to you and asks, "Oh, by the way, I heard that. Is it true? Are you okay? What's going on?" <laughs> <laughs> and like, "Okay, tell me if I'm wrong, man. Eh? If I uh, if I had way too much to drink." Uh, the thing is, I will blurt it out, but I will not name names. Uh, uh. It's like if you hear it, it's not for me, but it is for me. <laughs> no, God, please, no, no, no. Okay, but like, okay, no. but the thing is, some people can piece two and two together. Yeah. 
Yeah. I think another thing is that we trust way too much. Way too much. Way too way much. Too much. Too much. Yeah. I think no matter how close way you are to somebody, some things you should just keep to yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Take it from somebody who's had two ex best friends. <laughs>
all the school together, maybe we all hang out together, but then you know you're not being invited to certain things. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And it's like, and it's like so you're the only person in the every movie. Yeah. Exactly. Because yeah. I could understand if kids are going to buy the baba. But you're like, am I the drama? <laughs> <laughs> Friends who are not honest with you, like they lie. They just, they, I don't know, your friends out, I don't know. And then instead of telling you who they, she's with, guys, I don't know how to put it. Let's say she's with some other guys. She won't say, instead of saying that, maybe she'll say, Oh no, I'm out with Simak Mangara, another friend. Me, Elemaka. Kana, how much? Oh, where are you going from here? She said, Oh no, I'm just gonna get, visit my mans, and then from there, yeah, like me, only to find out. And then, jiggy jiggy group picture. Exactly, the location. Kana, oh, mana, moji status in Zaba to Baba. Well, how do, and how it's do you like, feel about friends who are not honest with you? And it's like, dude, even if you hide me from your shit, we share the same circle of friends. Yeah. Something yeah. somewhere is gonna yeah. pop up. Yeah. Don't lie. Why yeah. do you lie? Like, do, 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 do you guys think that these are the reasons why they lie? Emma? I think I'm not saying. Mm-hmm. And also start like, don't don't be scared to disinvite me. Be like, uh, yeah, like I think I think this would go better without you here. And also don't take it personal when you're uninvited to something because at least they were honest with you. Mm. Yes. 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 for me, I'd say I used to lie about going out with a certain guy for my friend. <laughs> so I used to lie. It's not a good thing. It's not a good thing. <laughs> My friend would call me out on my bullshit guy, this guy. When you go, you were a hypocrite every time you keep going back to that guy. So I would lie for I'm with someone else. So that they hold, they don't hold you accountable. Yes. So, I don't know. Sometimes I'd say, "Bang, bang, 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 <laughs> Reciprocation in friendship. Yo! You know, every birthday you plan out, I'm like your friend, I'm like, you give. Sometimes it's just being a friend, you know, let's say you see something in the shop that reminds you of them, you get it from them, but they never ever reciprocate the same. Mm-hmm. And it's like, even when you actively yeah. remind them, I'm big on them. I, yeah, I'm so big. I mean, I I Personally, like, yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> okay, let's <laughs> end Ditching your friends for a man. Yes, right. I feel we need to capture the background, hey? Yeah, 
this. I have to. Um, come on, I have to go. Hey, I'm hey. going to. Hey. 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 No, Ghana. In life, you need to have a balance. You need to. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not even people who are married behave like that, guys. I don't. I think. Let's think about it. So, Kerabodi, listen. What I'm trying to say is, I get an entire person is Kerabodi. Everything you do, it's your man. Uh, what about balancing? Sometimes yeah, you need to see your friends. Right. Sometimes you need to be with your family. No, Sometimes, but to that. like not even just being with your man all the time. But mm -hmm. oh, texting, calling, mm -hmm. this, that. But isn't it obsession? How that is Allah? No, like, I think it's just it's, yeah, it's not obsession. But I don't know what the term for it is. It's like when people go into relationships, they feel like everything they do about their life should revolve around the relationship. And it's, and it's like it remember that you're also an individual. Mm -hmm. Remember that. Okay, what happens you after what? What happens after it is? Because if you absorb into your man's world so much, can't you? You're gonna get tired of it because all you know, all you eat, breathe, and live, yeah, 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 yeah. and you actually find yourself and, toxic. and you actually find yourself being overly dependent on, on him, him. Mm -hmm. even emotionally. Like mm -hmm. when he's not there, you're just depressed. You're only happy when he's there. Even mm -hmm. when you're with your best friends or friends, you're just gonna. Um, um, Stop it. Get some help. Stop being jealous of your other friends. Yeah, no, I got it at first we were talking about Not friends who are jealous, now it's yeah. us. Have you ever found yourself in a position where Yes. You're not happy. Maybe you're not happy, but you feel a certain way when something happens to someone else. But maybe it's like, no, yeah. no, I don't know. That's why I'm saying for I don't know how I put it. Is it jealousy or you know, I think it's it's, remember what I was saying? It's, it's like really you don't want to take it from them, mm -hmm. but you, you also wish you were going through the yeah. same kind of positivity. So that's mm -hmm. what I say that feeling, but that is a natural feeling that you really yeah. have. Yeah. It's a natural feeling. But not really saying But if you drink it all now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's when you have a problem. Yeah. 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 I, I feel like it's only if you should be act out on it. Yeah. 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 I don't know if it should, should go with boundaries or whatever, but when it comes to reprimanding your friends, it's always meant to be in a positive light. Mm -hmm. So, what's your guys' takes on um, friends who say, yeah, they're reprimanding me, but they're not saying it in the right way or doing it, you know, how you were saying that maybe you're not ready to let go of that ex. Yeah, no, you thought of your friend, I would tell you that I would know, but you, you know, you need to let go of this person because why, 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 yeah. whatever. But then they do it now, instead of doing it like that, they... I don't think it's not the issue, it's just the way you say. Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, you should yeah. always recommend your friends in a positive way. I put I them in a positive people, light. Like, regardless of whatever it is we are addressing, especially when it involves mm. another person, you need to be mindful of your approach. Because mm. sometimes it's not even the news you're delivering, it's how you're delivering mm. it that then mm. yeah. triggers the other person to respond how mm. they're responding. Healthy communication, yeah. I'm all for that. Then if they don't understand what you're trying to say, they, they are the wrong one in the community. No, but also my thing is, <laughs> yes. my thing oh. is sometimes you can bring up something and it becomes heated, and it's like, okay, give it time to simmer down, then have the conversation again. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. That's definitely true. Anyway, that's everything. Yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the discussion, the conversation. Uh, if you did, if you. Hey! There's a lot going on. Anyway, if you guys did enjoy this video, please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.